Hi, welcome to my channel. I'm doing my haul a little different this time. I'm actually taping inside the Dollar Tree. I'm gonna have another haul coming up and I'm gonna show you exactly what I bought. In the meantime, let's go inside and take a look at what they have. So when you first come in, they have this wonderful selection of summery things, um, cups, things for barbecues, things for picnics, little bowls and plates and all kinds of fun things. And they had these humongous cups and coconuts and all of these other things. But then as I'm looking, I see there is a transition and a big transition um, back to school things. We have pencils and pens and tape, all kinds of things, glue, crayons, um, more notebooks, all kinds of back to school things. Now I just want to go right back to those big, huge cups. I mean, they're really cute. It says, hello, sweet summer. And the other one says, tropical, let me see, tropical life, both huge. I could never drink that much. But anyway, they also have those coconuts. So, so retro looking. Okay, they have a big selection of flip flops. Believe in yourself. I love that one. And there's actually a drink, um, recipe on one of them so cute mermaid tails you have to love that very cute like the polka dots but i'll tell you this is probably one of my favorite pair and that is the strawberries it's really nice okay so i went into their crafting section and they do have lots and lots of wooden things um, that you can paint and craft and of course we like to look for things that we can decoupage and most of these wooden things are definitely good for decoupaging for painting and using your Mod Podge and napkins or fabric, whatever you like, um, with the wooden things that the Dollar Tree has in their crafting section. They have uh, quite a few things. They also have those trays, those are fun. Oh, also they have these. Now remember when we use our glue guns, we need to protect our fingers. So pick up a pack of those. In this section, they had things for garage sales and they had chalk and they actually had Sharpies. I was looking for a black one. They only had blue and red and just a black and fine line. Um, here's some more of the wooden things that they have. Um, there's the trays again and some of the rope. Those are my favorite crates that they have. They're the ones that are solid. They don't have like the slats. I love them. I find them really fun to decoupage with. So I went into the sock area and I have what socks there and they're pretty decent. Um, I have to say lots of different varieties. But these two really caught my eye. If you like to do sock projects around the holidays, these two pair definitely look like something that you can make with that pattern and those colors. They're really cute. Of course, I couldn't do, uh, it wouldn't be a trip without me going into the uh, air freshener <laughs> and getting some Glade. Here are some jars. I thought the jars were really cute. They have lots of different kinds and they even have lids. That one is very, very pretty. I mean, I'm gonna say these with the black top, um, I don't recommend those. That top comes off very, very easily. I learned the hard way. I saw these, these are the little berry garlands and I think that this is the most I have ever seen in any Dollar Tree. They had all different kinds. Most of it looks like they're for fall, but the green and white I think are good for now um, during the summer. Um, but they are gearing up towards fall, so I am seeing things here and there. Um, probably more than I'd like to in June, but that's okay. There's some other things I found. That little um, bucket, that's actually metal. I love these with that little rope handle. It looks very, very nautical. These I also thought were nice. They are made out of glass, and they are kind of weighty. It's nice. They look like that mercury glass and very pretty. Those would be good for the holidays, I think, too. Next, I went someplace I don't normally go, and that's into where the food is. I saw the Crunch and Munch. I didn't even know they still made that. That was something we used to love to have all the time. They have a couple different flavors. Then I went over and I started looking at some of their cookies, of course, um, vanilla and chocolate cookies, and these, which was one of our favorites when we were growing up also, marshmallow cookies. My mother used to put the butter rings on our fingers, so those brought back a little bit of a memory. There's some more vanilla creams. Coconut, again, this is ones my mother used to get when I was a child. That's all I could think about when I saw them. They have oatmeal cookies. My favorite cookie, probably, or one of them, ginger snaps. Oh, and almond windmills, too. Another cookie that my mother used to get. And there's my favorite, lemon cream. These are potato nochi. I hope I'm saying that right. My sister buys these every time she goes to the Dollar Tree. They're from Italy, and she loves them. She has some really good recipes. Well, she's really a good cook. Then I saw these, 
um, pastry crisps. They have them in apple cinnamon and mixed berries. I didn't buy them, but I'm kind of wondering if they're like pop tarts and ooh, there's some more of that fiddle faddle and I love that. So I went into the plastic ware and the containers and I have bought this one with that little snap on lid. And I have to tell you, they leak, both sizes leak and I would say just use it for dry things um, so you won't have that problem. This is their parchment paper. For the iron on method, I don't recommend it. Get Reynolds, it works better. Okay, so in their floral section, um, they have tons and tons of things for fall. When I first walked in the door, um, I was really surprised because again, we're just in June. But look at all those colors, the oranges and the yellows, and those are leaves and sunflowers. Um, if you do any of the wreaths or anything, Harvest, happy fall, y'all. I'd love to have that sign. Um, anyway, now would be the time to go in and grab some of those florals. They do have some plastic tablecloths, and again, for fall, um, perhaps even Thanksgiving, but I did notice these down at the bottom, those tropical ones. I love those. Let's go with all the plates and everything that I showed you before. Now, these were at the front of the store. Um, these are also for fall. I tell you, those really remind me of snowmen. Um, when I first saw them, that's what I thought they were. And they have these in green and white. And as you can see, they have like leaves embossed in them. I think those would be fun to decoupage. I mean, that's why we go to the Dollar Tree. We look for things we can decoupage. We look for things we can use around the house. And I saw these are little ring holders. My sister and I collect mermaids. So I decided, well, I'm going to buy this one. So that's one thing that did come home with me. Next up is what I bought from the Dollar Tree and my plans for them. You're not going to want to miss that, so please subscribe to my YouTube channel. Give me a thumbs up, drop a comment, please share with your friends. See you soon.